where you're from, Stevie? Glasgow, Scotland. Yeah. And uh, what you did, uh, well, why don't you give everybody a little sample of what you do? Okay. We'll do a one easy one with a light bulb. Do you right. want to check it, make sure it's for real? Yeah. This is a light bulb. It's a small, I can't, is it 25, 12 watt? Something like that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. 12 watt. We're going to suck watt. the light bulb in, bring them back up, and then we'll start swallowing some money. Stevie! Stevie! Oh, wow! How'd you do that? Oh, you like that? Here's the practice. I used to, when I was really young, I used to swallow my pocket money and bring it up again. And then years later, try different things. Because once you get pocket money, you had to give the staff savings for holidays. I stayed in our children's home. So you grew up in, a, in what we call an orphanage? Yes. I was in there for 18 years. And when they asked you for your savings, I would say I spent it. But I didn't really. I swallowed it. So they'd come in and I'd say, OK. The punishment would be go to your bedroom. So I'd get into the room, lock the door, hit my chest, and up it came. <laughs> so you got the money back. And then now we used to use it for shoplifting. <laughs> How'd you do that? Oh, no problem, man. We about six of us used to get into shopping with us. We'd distract. The, and you, so you would go around and shoplift out of the. Yeah, store, no, we'd right? just say to the lady, we'd distract a lady and we'd say to her, give us a half pound of those. And then right. she turned around, I'd grab all the chocolate eggs. <laughs> <laughs> and then you'd come outside <coughs> with you all your buddies. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, what else are you going to do? Uh, I've got some half dollar coins here written from one to five. I'm going to swallow... Are they half the... dollars? No, they're uh -huh. half dollars. I said they were quarters. They're half dollars. Okay. Uh, I'm going to swallow those. And... They're all numbered. Yep. Yeah. And when I actually put them in, you'll actually hear them click and hit off one another when they drop down inside. Okay? And not only that, well, then I'm going to go to the audience and find out how you want them brought them up. Which, which, uh, which number you want to come out first. <laughs> Is that possible? We'll find okay, out. Okay, you do it. I have to Number do one. What do I have to do? Just feed it in my mouth. <laughs> now, you obviously don't hear the first one. There's nothing there. Number two. Just remember the guy's got two and a half bucks down there. <laughs> <laughs> and here's five. the fifth. <laughs> okay. No, you can have any. Now he's got you like. five, five half dollars down there, right? All right. Wait a second. Which <laughs> one do you want him to bring up right this second? Stand up. Um, three. Three. On this way up. I have to tell you that everything comes up dry, nothing comes up wet. If I show you that there, there you go. That number. number. <laughs> that number. Five. Coming up. Bring up number five. <laughs> <laughs> we show this one. Oh, can we do that one again? Oh, really? <laughs> show everybody what you did. What number was it? Four. Okay. <laughs> All right. I forgot where it went. He, one. He messed up. Let's see you mess up like this. Bring no, up I've number got, one, Stevie. I've got a cold. <laughs> Bring up number one, Stevie. <laughs> Just because I had a cold and I forgot where that one went. There we number are. One. Number one. Yeah. One. Okay. What one? Number two. two. Coming up for you. Number two. <laughs> Wouldn't it be great working in a fries, McDonald's? <laughs> Your fries. <laughs> We show this one to camera. You can see it. <laughs> All right. Two. So, so bring up the last number one, yeah? three. Okay. <coughs> <laughs> Stevie, bring it up. Let me tell you, the last one has actually got stuck in here somewhere. So what we have is a number seven billiard ball. We're going to put the ball in. As the ball goes down, the money will come up and the ball will come back. Oh, boy.
Oh, you got the sugar? This is, this, this is the amazing one. This is true. What happens when sugar goes into water, right? Dissolves. Dissolves. Immediately, correct? Yeah, that's what happens, you see. Water and sugar, it gets wet. What we're going to do is put the sugar into one part of the tummy, drink a glass of water, put it to another part, and bring the sugar back dry. Okay? <laughs> Yeah. Coffee? <laughs> okay, it's coming up. Let's see one of your rings. You got a ring? No. Get a, g give a ring. Come on. Just bring it off. Here's a ring. What are you going to do with a ring? Oh, really good one. Now, what I have is a small padlocking key, and I need you to lock that for me. Can someone lock? Could you oh, lock you that for lock, me? You want to lock? Yes, and pull out the key. Make sure it's definitely locked. I'm going this? to put your ring into the tummy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait a second. Is that locked? Whoop, I dropped it. Is that locked, right? We know it's locked. Is it locked? Yeah. Okay, it's locked. Okay, so we have the lock padlock. Can you put the lock padlock in my mouth, please? In your mouth. Thank Which you. Which way, anyway? Any you like. <laughs> Pop in the key. <laughs> and the key? Yep. Now what we're going to do is put the key into the padlock Unlock him, take your ring, I don't put him into this. the lock, lock him, no, take this out the key, happen. This and is, bring him back again. This is Houdini <laughs> stuff. Okay, it just takes a few seconds. <laughs> I've actually got the key going in, we're just waiting for him to unlock. The finale of the show, normally we swallow uh, two live goldfish and keep them in for 20 minutes and bring them up still swimming. And the oldest fish I use is eight and a half now. <laughs> Okay, we have the key in, we've got my lock, we've got your ring in. He has a tiny bit of sugar on him, but I'm taking them off for you. Do you have to check that? How, how does that happen? Can I give that back to you? No, I don't want to touch it. <laughs> Put it down there, we'll do it after. What do you got now? The, the I got key. To open it. So we put the key back in there. We should be able to unlock it. And we can give you back your ring. Click. Open up. Voila. There you go. Thank Very you. Good. You have a question? Quick question. Go ahead. I just want to know if you're ever are you ever scared of um, getting choked or I mean, those, that ball is very big. <laughs> Actually, the, the bigger the ball, the easier it is. The larger the object, the easier to do. Oh, by the way, I heard that you're going up to St. Andrews. Yes, I'm going to play golf. <laughs> Maybe this will come in handy for you. Oh, very good. We'll take that All with right. you. <laughs> now, everybody, that's amazing. Stevie is the only person in the world who does this. So don't even think about trying this yourself at home. You could put yourself in significant danger. Don't try this. That's our disclaimer. You're going to come back a little bit later on. Okay. Because guess what? This savvy, smart New York public that we know about in this town, right? We sent Stevie out onto the streets. You won't want to miss seeing what happens when Stevie surprises some unsuspecting New Yorkers. <laughs> we'll be right back after this. Stevie, Stevie.